planning on just kind of chilling for a couple of days? Uh, I don't know. I'll probably do a little recovery, cold tub, some sauna, massages, relaxing, playing a video game, studying some film, all that good stuff. When will you start thinking about playing for real? I've been thinking about that. Ever since we lost to the Jaguars, I've been thinking about playing again. So, yeah, I'm always thinking about playing football. That's what I do. What have you been thinking since then? Has, has it been anger inside you, disappointment, mad? Uh, I wouldn't say angry or nothing. I'll just say just excitement, just ready for the opportunity that we have, you know, in front of us as a team. Uh, as an offense, defense, special teams, so just looking forward to playing, you know, a great season. Mike, having a, a new offense here, does it excite you at all that you'll get maybe a little bit of an element of surprise in that first game against Miami because nobody's really seen you guys play? Yeah, yeah, yeah for sure, for sure. Uh, it's been it's been different. Everybody lined up in different spots, doing different jobs, but it's been working out. Uh, we've had a lot of big plays since camp. Uh, Still continue to do that, still continue to grow and, uh, you know, make the adjustments you need to make. But, yeah, I mean, like you said, year one in the offense. So, obviously, it's a learning curve where everybody catching on. Uh, you know, we adding and getting more comfortable uh, week in and week out. During your time at Clemson, they were a very good team, but hadn't quite reached that, that championship level. You were part of the team that broke through. What do you remember? about those experiences and how can that help you help these guys get over that hump? Uh, well, I think at, at Clemson, we had a lot of guys who wanted the same thing. Uh, I'll stand it there, you know, it's best. So we don't do nothing less than that. And uh, everybody had that mindset. And uh, the previous year before we won it, uh, we lost in the national championship and we all just wanted to get back and go back again and win it. So we all just kind of had that mindset that it was going to dominate every week. Uh, kind of similar. We kind of came off a tough loss last year. Uh, now we got a lot of guys back who still got that taste in them out. And uh, I mean, just try not to let that happen again. Uh, put our best foot forward and, you know, see what happens. Mike, we uh, just heard from Joey. He said that as he gets older, you know, he appreciates the seasons more, you know, more so maybe than he did as a rookie. Do you have the same sort of mindset as the years go by to kind of savor these so, moments? They go by so fast, though. I feel like I just was coming here, uh, meeting everybody, going on year seven now. I feel like an old guy, I feel like one of the older guys in the locker room. But yeah, I mean, it happens so fast. So you just gotta enjoy every day for real, for real. That's that's what that's my take on it. Just enjoy every day. Uh, don't take no day for granted. Does the urgency change? No one, the clock's ticking. And uh, if you want to get to that top level. Not if you always have that sense of urgency when you show up. I don't think it's no different. You know, you I always had the same sense of urgency. Uh, show up, do my job, make plays, uh, watch film, make the corrections, and just stick to the routine. Mike, you mentioned the guys moving around a little bit more. I think we talked earlier in training camp about you playing in the slot a little bit more. Keenan's talked about in those looks, getting some more opportunities outside, one on one. How have you, how have you felt like Keenan's looked in some of those situations oh. on the outside? Keenan being Keenan. <laughs> I mean, we've been seeing it for a long time. Uh, He's been doing it for a long time. Keenan is being Keenan, uh, slaying everybody, making plays, having fun. Uh, yeah, we all out there having fun, making plays, so we're just enjoying it. 